Hey guys, welcome to Strong with Raj. No nonsense strength training. So this is uh, my sped up version of my extra warm up. There are days that I need a little bit more warm up, more uh, non specific, more general type, like going under the bar and stuff like that. And I was pretty um, motivated to hit my depth as I have just realized recently that my depth wasn't optimal. I was not going below parallel and at least two people commented and I had a good look into my videos. And this was the session where I was going to go do a medium to light weight, a uh, fair bit of volume. In this case, seven sets of five. I know it's not a lot of volume, but for me it is. So anyway, that's why I did a little bit more of a warm up to get a feel of what needs to be done. I changed my camera angle more at almost at profile, it, not three o'clock, but it's like four o'clock and just did a few random stretches as well, apart from doing squats and lightweight squats and holding the squat position. So. I was programmed to start doing some light or medium squats as well leading up. I mean, finishing with my 180 kg, 170 kg, 190 kg attempts. So yes, it was time to go back to the drawing board, back to the basic, I suppose, and really accept that I was not hitting my depth regularly and start working on it. So thanks to those two guys who commented and uh, made me improve and reflect on my form a lot more. In doing this, I, I, I was there in the gym for quite a while, which I don't mind. And I ended up doing seven sets of five and a fair bit of warm-up sets before that. And now I'm coming to the title of this video, the most fun you can have with your pants on. Yes, it is quite true. I really enjoyed this session, really had so much fun. It may not make sense to a lot of people. Um, how can it be fun squatting fairly heavy weight? And for a number of reps, that is quite big for me. I would normally do three sets of five, two sets of, you know, sorry, three sets of three types. But I had been programmed to do volume and medium weight. And this was after a long time I was doing this. I was able to check my form in between as I was doing the live video and I was hitting the depth. So combination of all that uh, made me think, wow, this is so much fun. I didn't say exactly that. I actually literally had this voice in my head. So much fun with my pants on, something like that. I, I have to say that during my set, as you can see, you I don't think of anything. It just happens. I sometimes run the, the cues for my form in my mind. Otherwise, in between the sets, I do take three to four minutes of break. That is when that voice comes. And it's not voice in a disturbing way. They're all very positive stuff. And uh, I would also say they're kind of statements. Uh, I do believe that we experience thoughts as words and sounds and images. I, I think I perceive them more as sounds and voices. And I, I do get them in between my sets, as I mentioned. And oh my God, I was in heaven. Literally, I was enjoying this light to medium weight. I was enjoying hitting my depth. I was enjoying how just the right balance of weight it was it was challenging yet not very easy and goodness absolutely having fun with my pants on i do believe i have done exercises and being into fitness for a long time and uh, there has been times when i've thought that most people perceive them as not a very pleasurable things to do but they still do it because it is quite good for you and they do it as a necessity, as a chore. And I've seen it myself when I trained uh, people with uh, in boot camp scenario or in group classes, especially when it's time for cardio, they will all get very uh, unhappy. Uh, they will say things to me, you are cruel, you are a hard taskmaster. And it is quite uh, 
true that we experience hardships we go through some you know voluntary hardship uh, to the point i would even say torture in the form of exercises knowing very well that it is good for you knowing very well that there, at the end there's a reward we all know the cycle of endorphins that we get from exercise but this is different in between the sets where i should be saying fuck i who shit what is all this why am i doing this this is not good let's go home no i was there for good two and a half hours i think and i did not think of going back home which some things i do i do think of what's going to happen next what i what i'm going to do next but not in this session it was so much fun uh it was so far away from the typical experience that people have whilst they're doing the exercise and me taking my rest my sets is in the middle of the whole workout and not a single voice of that kind of negativity or hating this none of that and i just wanted to share that with you guys i hope this kind of experience these voices such as this is the most one i'm having with my pants on or i could just be here this is amazing there's nobody nowhere else i want to be i think those voices are very important to entertain and keep in your mind more often than not otherwise exercise lifting session workouts they can become quite a chore and uh, i think it is it is going to last less longer if you have such voices or such experiences i'm not saying that we can all have great session every single time but i'm just sharing what i experienced in this session medium weight sets of 5 seven sets or eight sets whatever it was i loved it it was absolutely great and i really hope that you enjoy my experience and hope to go get that as well please like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one thank you